We're live. I was on your pages the first time. I went live with you the first time. Hello. I deleted it though, so we're good. Alright. Excuse me, this is live now. I just realized I've never actually been on live on Facebook. Hey guys, how's it going? Hello. Welcome to your 5 p.m. cardio kickboxing class. We will get started in just a couple seconds as people start to come in. Um, so for cardio kickboxing today, you are going to need yourself, have some water with you. And if you want to have a mat, feel free to have a mat. We're not going to be going down to the floor for anything, uh, but in case you want to wipe your face, um, get that sweat off, um, definitely have that mat with you. Otherwise, I do have Nina behind me. Um, I think we've introduced ourselves enough, so at this point, you kind of know who we are already. If not, I'm Justin, she's Nina. <laughs> All right, so we are going to get started in a couple seconds. Ready to start? Yes, let's do it. All right, we're gonna jump right on in. Hello, Nina, hi. Hi, Paula, can you guys hear the music? Just want to make sure you guys can hear it. All right. Well, I'm going to go ahead and say you guys can hear the music. You can hear us. Let's get it started. So, let's just start with our feet. Under the hips, knees are nice and soft. And just roll the shoulders back and down, keeping the chest up. Knees soft, start to relax the shoulders. We start to tense up. We start to get a little nervous when we don't know what's going on. So let's just relax. Nothing crazy. Let the blood flow through your body. Let the breath come in and let the breath come out. We're gonna go into side to side rotations. Widen your stance just a little bit. Let's go side to side. Now let's make a little fist with the hands. So for the fist, throw the fingers in, thumbs go under, and just rotate side to side, rotating through the hip, and lifting that heel off the floor. Take it nice and easy, starting to engage the core. There we go. All right, so from here, we're gonna start with the lower body first. Lines and slow squats, toes point out, knees are soft. Take it on down and rise back up. Take your time, sitting the hips back and down, chest up, abs on. There we go, sitting back in that chair. If you wanna go a little wider, you can go a little wider, that's up to you. Keep that going. All right, team. Let's get the blood flowing nice and slow. All right, we got some hip openers. Let's start with the leg fronts. Open the hip, step, step. Other side. Now it's up to you. You can go high. You can bring the knee right up to the hip, or you can stay low. Whatever's comfortable for you. It's your hip. You know it best. So keep it going. All right, perfect. Keep moving. Keep going. Hello, Nina. Hey, Shawnee. Oh, thanks for letting us know, Paula. Hi, Kelly. All right, guys. Cross punch. Hands up. Side to side. Nice and easy. There you go. So you want to go across the body. You got a target on the side about 45 degrees or so, and that's where you're punching. With the two big knuckles in the front, you want to twist the hips, lift the heel, and turn. That's going to get you full range of motion. Keep your knees safe. And you just look a little cooler that way. So let's keep it here. So we're going to start with a little more shoulder activation. Feet are wide. Take it down nice and slow, and let's walk the plank. Walk it forward into plank position. Palms under shoulders, elbows soft. Walk it right back in. There we go. Stay low. Let's go again. Let's see how many more we can get. Maybe two more, maybe one more. Knees are soft, heels are grounded. Last one, last one. There we go. All right, take your time, slowly bring it up. Shuffle in place. That's your warm up. Ooh, man, right? yeah. Blood's going. Perfect. Keep it moving. Keep it going. All right. 
I'm getting used to Facebook Live. I'm still new to this. Hey, Gisela, how are you? All right, Shani. Paola, yes, there is a schedule. It will be online every day. So that's the end of your warm up. Shake it out. Roll the shoulders. Our first block of work. We're going to start this hand up. Feet are going to be nice and wide. You're going to punch down to the floor and then give me a jack. Punch down, same side, and give me a jack, just like that. Punch down, jack. So for now, relax. Same leg with your hand. You're going to step in and take it out to a roundhouse. Bring it back in, out, and roundhouse. We're going to put those moves together. For now, let's just worry about the first one. So these are the moves. She's warming up the hips a little more. So relax, shake it out. First move coming up. Drink some water if you need to. Ready to go? All right, team. Feet wide, hand up. Let's punch it down. One jack and down. Same side. Keep the other hand right by the face the entire time. Elbow tucked in, light on the toes. Your option, squat down and punch. Squat and punch or add the jack. There we go. A little more activation. Just 10 seconds to go. That roundhouse kick is coming in three, two, one. Step it in, kick, step it out. There we go. So take it nice and slow. Find out what's going on with your body. And when you're ready, you can go a little faster, a little harder. Now for the roundhouse, you can kick low, you can kick half, or you can kick high. All you need to do is control the hips, control the knee, you wanna point first, and then fire it out before you bring it right back in. Let's put it together. Three, two, one, punch and kick. Punch and kick, there we go. Nice and seamless, let it flow through the body. Let it feel natural. Turn the hips, step, Kick, turn, there we go. Remember the hips have to turn. Find your balance. <laughs> All right, there we go. Punch and kick, punch and kick. All right, almost there, almost there. 10 seconds to go. Ooh, butt, butt cheek. I can feel it a little bit. What's going on? And hold. Ooh. Can we do the same thing on the other side? Same thing on the other side? Yeah, we can. All right. Hello, Laura. Welcome in. All right, team. We did one hand. Let's do the other one. Feet are wide. Three, two, one. Let's get down. Punch and jack. Same side. You want to point that toe out to keep the knee safe. Jack. Point it out twist as you turn. There you go. So you're starting with the lower body. Everything starts with the lower body. Twist to get the power through the core. In. You can exhale on the way out. You're going to do a little more. Roundhouse kick come in. Three, two, one. Step, kick, back, in. Woo. There we go. Perfect team. Your hand placement, up to you. Just find your balance. You can have it in and out, or you can go a little more natural with the feel and let it flow. There we go. Oh yeah, you guys are doing good. Keep it going. How about we put both moves together? Three, two, let's go. Down, kick, down, and kick. There we go. Remember to turn the hips, lift the heel, to punch straight down to the floor. Bring it up, in, out, and in. There we go, you can go slow. You can slow it down if you're still getting a feel for the move, or you can pick up the tempo. You're gonna start to feel that booty squeeze, those blood cheeks, but it feels good. I think it feels good. What do you think? Oh my gosh. Good. <laughs> 10 seconds left, team, 10 seconds. There we go. Give me two more. Last one. Hold. Woo. That's your first block of work. That's it. Let us know how you're doing. 
Pull out a silly. Out of silly's on. All right, guys, so that was your first block. Relax, recover, drink some water. We're going into block two. Block two is a little longer, so you're gonna have to think about it a little more. But if you forget, that's okay. We'll let you know what's coming in. Ooh, Philippines, I love it. All right, team, round two. So, feet are gonna be right up on the hips, knees soft, heels grounded. One hand is just gonna go speed bag. That's it, nothing crazy. Three, two, speed bag, let's go. So nothing crazy, just getting a different joint action than we're used to. We're usually used to extending, bending, it's a little different. If you need to slow it down to kind of see what's going on, you can slow it down. And then as soon as you're ready, speed it up. Elbow line with shoulder. Only thing moving is that elbow as it goes around town. There we go. How about some front kicks? Yes. Switching up the lower body. Let's go. Kick. Switch. There we go. Keep the core engaged and try to stay upright for this one. For a little more activation and control from your lower abs. Now you can keep the hands up. That's okay. If you want a little more power behind it, pump the arm where the leg is kicking. We got uppercuts coming. Nice and simple uppers. We're gonna slow it down a little, feet wide. Hands up, side to side. There we go, keep the hands up. You wanna reset every time, bringing the elbow and the fist right by the face, every time. There we go, rolling through the shoulders. Perfect. Now for your uppercuts. A little tip for you. You wanna hold a pencil or a little marker in between the elbow to come up and that marker should stay there the entire time. Let's put it together. Four kicks, four uppers in place. Four, three, two, and upper. Four, three, two, and one. Four. There we go. Four, 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 four. Chest up, chest up, feet wide. Now it doesn't matter what side you're doing. Whatever side is comfortable to start with and whatever's comfortable to end with. We're gonna add some movement to this in just a second. Second round through. Don't worry about it. Now we got a little ladder drill coming up. Cause we have to have some cardio, right? But it's boxing. It's a little ladder drill. We're gonna start slow. Out, out, in, in. Once you've got it, you can go a little faster. You can follow Nina. She's going a little faster even. And if you want a little more, stay low as fast as you can. That's up to you. Choose your level, choose where you're working. You can stay here. <laughs> there we go, team. Light on the toes, keeping the heels lifted the entire time. Landing on the toes. Oh, those calves, those quads. Maybe the booty. It's gonna feel it. Almost there, 10 seconds. Nice and easy, and you get a little break coming. Woo! How are you guys doing? How are you guys feeling? Can we do that two more times? Yes! Two more times? She said yes. yes. What are you saying at home? I think you're saying yes. I think I'm saying, I think I'm hearing you want more. So round two. One hand speed back, other side. Let's go. You're gonna notice one side feels a little bit weirder, a little funkier than the other side. That's because one side is the hand that you use for everyday living. Grabbing your bag, grabbing your pencils, picking things up. Let's strengthen out both. Let's work two sides. Front kicks are coming up. All right, three, two, one, kick, switch, switch. There we go. Perfect. So for the kick, you want to bring the knee up, extend, back, and down. So you want to extend through the knee to kick, control it, retract, and down. You're going to feel it a little more if you slow it down. You can go fast too, that's okay. 
uppercuts. Let's get it. Up and up. Now try to stay grounded. Try your best to not bounce. You want to stay grounded. Nice and firm on the floor. Hands reset. If you want a little faster, ground yourself entirely. And let's go. Side to side. Shoulders turning. Abs are burning. All right, team. Combo. Four kicks, four uppers. Let's go. Four, three, two, uppers. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. How are we feeling, Nina? Great. Feeling good. Yes. We're not feeling a thing yet. Not in the body, right? It's all up here. <laughs> so let's fight for it. Let's fight with everything that we've got right here and right now. Because there's no better time than right now. Mm -mm. There we go. Last one, last one. We got the ladder drill coming up. Three, two, one. Let's go. Stay here. Ooh, a little faster. There you go. As light as you can. As fast as you can. Oh yeah, there we go. That's where it's at. Right up the legs, right up the quads. Soft on the toes, on the balls of your feet. So you've got your option. We get tired, that's normal, we're human. So take the option and take it slow whenever you need to and jump right back in. 10 seconds, 10 seconds. Ay, ay, ay. It burns. Three, two. <laughs> yeah. One more time. Can we do that one more time? Martha, hello. We miss you guys too. So, round three, my team. Round three. Let's do it. Now we did one hand, we did the other hand. Let's do it together to the front. Staying low in the squat, chest is up, abs are on, shoulders back and down. Remember to relax. Try not to go up here. That's no good. That's no fun, right? You gotta relax. Have fun with it. Enjoy the feel. All right, team, front kicks are coming. They're coming. In three, two, one, kick. There we go. Now for the kick, you can stay low. Nothing crazy here. If you're a little more flexible like Nina is, you might be able to go a little higher. Just a little bit, poquitito. But hey, maybe go a little more and kick all the way up. But remember, you want to control the body the entire time. All right, team, uppers are coming. Let's go. Upper, 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 upper. There we go. Remember, you can slow it down here. You can go for power in every strike or get a little more cardio out of it and power through. There we go. Remember to relax the shoulders. Now we have a combo coming and we're gonna travel for this one. Four forward and four back. Four kicks, four uppers. Let's go. Four, three, two, and uppers. Four, three. There we go. Taking it a little old school. A little old school. What was this? 80s? 90s? We got you guys. We got you. There we go. And if you want to stay in place, that's okay. Nina's going to travel, and I'll stay here with you guys. Whatever works for you. Just try not to kick anyone. <laughs> one more time. One more time. Last one, last one. Four, three, two, one, four, three, two, hold. Oh. Ladder drill. Didn't forget about this. Did you forget about this? I did. No. I did. Oh. <laughs> I thought you were going to say no. Let's go. Let's go. This is your last and final time. 
So this is where we give everything. The heart. Let it skyrocket right on up. And let's get it together. Together is how we move. This is how we grow. Woo. 15 seconds left. 15 seconds. All right, you'll hear that bass drop. I heard it too. <laughs> Five, four, three, two. How are you guys doing? Oh. Oh, hey, Ashley. Welcome in. I'm out of breath. Are you guys out of breath, too? It's not just us, right? Go back. Hello? <laughs> All right, team. That was two. Our last and final round. We're going to switch it up just a little bit. So let's get into a fighting position. Take one leg forward. Other leg is back. Toe points about 45. Lift the heel. Hands are up. You're going to go jab, cross, hook. Just like that. Jab, cross, hook. Let's go. Jab, cross, hook, reset. One, two, and three. Might be another way that you think about it. Jab, cross, hook. One, two, three. Whatever works for you. Reset every time. Keep the shoulders down. Rotate the hips and turn each and every time. You can speed it up, you can go faster, that's okay. You don't have to stay with us. Go at your own pace. Get a feel for the move, whether it's speed, power, or just knowing what's going on. Sometimes our brain takes a while to catch up. That's okay. Last one, last one, we have a double knee, back leg. Let's go. One, two, three sets. One, Two, and back. There you go. If you want a little more on the second one, add a hop and land softly. One, two, back. Oh yeah. Now you want to land softly, toe, ball, heel, and bend the knees to catch your weight on the way down. One, two, one more time. Let's put it together. Jab, cross, hook. One, two, double knee, go. One, Two, reset. One, two, three, two, and one. There we go. Once you got it, a little faster. One, one. Right there. <laughs> Option, add a hop. Look around yourself, find your footing, and take as long as you need to to reset before you go right back into it. Fighting stance. Oh yeah, one more time, one more time. Hold, feet wide, squat down, and rotate side to side. So chest is up, shoulders down, knees, track over the second and third toes, try keeping them above the heel if you can. Weight is in those heels and just rotate side to side. You're gonna feel the stretch along the core, along one side, up the other, kind of like a little X here. This is the line where you feel it across. Maybe you're just feeling the legs right now. Yep. Could just be legs, that's okay. Most important thing, hands in front of the chest the entire time. If the hands aren't in front of the chest, hold on to it nice and tight, and then they'll definitely be there. Relax, recover. Can we do the same thing on the other side? Sure. Other side? Why not? I think so. Quick, quick feet. Oh, yeah. All right, team. Other leg forward. Round. Hands up. It's a one, a two, and a three. One, two, three. Let's go. One, two, three. Hold. Go. Perfect. So on the jab, shoulder comes forward just a little, weight shifts, then it shifts again, and then it shifts again. Reset. One, two, three. Now in order to keep your knees safe, to keep them protected, you have to turn the hips. So turn, turn, and turn. See how that heel is lifting? Getting a nice long line up. 
That's keeping me safe. That's keeping us protected. And the elbow comes up and across the center of the face, right in the middle of the face. Last one. Double knees. Let's go. One, two, two, and one. Oh, yeah. Option. And a hop. Land softly. Perfect. You can stay here. No jump needed. Take your time. Recover. Relax. Can you give me one more? Yes. Combo. Put it together. One, two, three, and a double. Let's go, team. Let's go. One, two. It's your five move combo. When did you think you'd be doing a five move combo? Today? Yes. Yeah, because you're doing it today. Let's go. One, two, three, two. Option, add the hop. But you gotta land soft. You gotta land quietly like a ninja. There we go. That music is definitely helping us stay quiet. And if you hear us land, let us know. Let us know in the comments below. Last one, last one. Low squat, rotate. Let's go. Side to side. It's a little side view for you. Knee comes out. Right in line with that heel. Chest stays up. Side to side. Lower body doesn't move. Only thing moving is the top half. Maybe it's that little part we want to work off. I know I want to work it off. That's why I'm here. To work it off with you. So let's rotate side to side. Hands in front of the chest. Little extra tip, try to push the floor together right under you. See if you can push your feet to get that floor a little closer. There we go. Whew. Seven seconds. Four, three, two. Oh my God. All right. How you doing? Oh my God, team, how you doing? Margaret, no worries. This will still be on our story right after this workout is done. So you can still catch us there. All right. We're not done yet though. We've got one final block left. I know I said it was only three blocks. I didn't lie to you. Three blocks of work and we have our recovery portion. So let's relax. Shake out the legs. Take a nice deep breath, inhale. And exhale. Uno más, uno más. All right, hand center. Now think of a little ball here. Let's go energy ball, side to side, and feel the weight as it shifts. Because one side gets heavier, one side gets lighter. Maybe I should have switched the music to kind of match what we're doing. That's okay. Let's stick with the beat if we can. Find your own beat. Find your own rhythm. Last time, step it in, quad stretch. Bring that leg on up, take your time. If you need to hold on to the wall, you can hold on to the wall next to you. Or just look at something that's not moving. Stop in the other knee. Other side, switch. Ooh. You guys did it. Yeah, I'm talking to you. You did it. How do you feel? Because we feel good. So let us know how you're feeling. Arm across the body. Relax the shoulder, let it go down to the back. Shoulders and ears aren't friends today. Maybe in bed when you're laying down, they're friends. Not right now. Other side. Shake your hips. <laughs> All right, team, you guys did amazing. So take that selfie, get some recovery, relax a little. Join us at 6 p.m. We got some more fun coming your way. So reach on forward, rounding out the back, and then take it on nice and wide. Take everything in, and then push out all the negativity, all the negatives, push it out. 
and take in all the good stuff. All the good food. Maybe some pizza. And push out, last one. Bring it back in. Hands together. Give yourself a round of applause. Congratulations. You guys got through it. Hello, Belinda. We're so glad you are loving it. Carla, viva otra vez, yo también. All right. We hope to see you guys soon. Come back at 6 o'clock. Sweaty selfie time. Hashtag choose movement. We are doing a little raffle away. If you know what a Theragun is, that's awesome. If you have no idea what it is, doesn't matter. It's worth a lot of money, and it's really good for recovery. So hashtag choose movement on your selfie. Post it on Instagram. Let us know. Tag us at choosefitness.com. So that way we can see what you guys are doing. Have a great night. See you soon.